What's going on you that what's going on YouTube? It's Frizzly here. Right, I know this is kind of a different video for me to make, but uh I decided I want to change up my content a little bit and play some beats I made and go over like how I make them. So if you haven't already, can you please subscribe? I'm trying to hit 1k. Uh so can you please subscribe for that? And, uh, yeah, all my socials will be down in the, in the description anyway. So let's get into it. So for this beat, uh I wanted to make a kind of a fast trap beat, so I started off with this sample here, and this is what it sounds like. So yeah, um, the next thing I done was add in these hi hats. It's kind of a simple hi hat pattern here, just with a kind of other little fancy sort of. Um, fast parts and the hi-hats, yep, so here's what it sounds like. Next I added in a snare, this snare here. Um, and it's just simple, you know, simple uh, snare pattern. Next I added in this, uh, the perks percussion. So this is a, just a sort of, um, I don't really know what to call this, it's a bongo drum sort of thing and I don't even know what that is but it sounds cool so I layered them both together and these are what these sound like next add in the 808 now for this beat this is one of the most important parts so I wanted to make sure the the 808 and the bass hit hard so Added in 188 from Simon Servita's pack. Uh, sounds like this. Okay, and I layered it with uh, the 3x oscillators uh, sub bass, so it get, gives more of a more more low end in the bass. So yeah, see so here's what it sounds like together. And also these slides here, oops, uh, these slides on this part in here. Also, I wanted to add the slides in actually because it creates more of kind of a, I don't know, a unique sort of um, pattern that catches your eye, uh, your ear, <laughs> your eye, <laughs> your ear more. Uh, next is the kick. Here's what the kick sounds like. There is quite a lot going on there, but I that's what I aim for. Um now next is one of my favourite part my favourite parts of the beat is the brass. So I added this brass sound here. Right? And then it plays like this. I also put one uh, on octave below. So it creates more depth in the, the brass. And here's a little bass part add for this intro part. I'll play it to you in a minute. I layered that with um, a sub bass as well to create more bass in the, the beat. Um, yeah, and that's about it. And also some, some risers and uh, drum fills and stuff. So this is what these kind of sound like here. Um, and also some Vox stuff, so yeah, and then like that. And the last thing I done was obviously arrange the beat um, and add in some automations. So for the hi hats, instead of starting the beat off like this, like fast, I wanted to slow it down a bit, so. On the mixer track of the hi hats, I added in half time, so then it's basically cuts. Well, it slows the hi hats down and uh, drops them one octave down. So for here, this part here, I'll just play the hi hats on its own. Like that. Yeah. 
and then when the actual drop hits I sped them up so I turned off the automation here as you can see right here um what else I'd add oh yeah isotope vinyl for the sample here at the start so what this does is it creates more well you can it kind of makes it sound more vintage and well I suppose older and you can turn out the year so you can go to 1930 kind of cuts out the high end and low end uh, kind of makes it more muffled so it sounds a lot more vintage um, and yeah so that's start for the intro and that cuts off when the the bass and that hits here like that right and then last thing is the pan pan man for the sample and that's just slowly pan around here and both sides of the uh, the headset or your speakers anyway so yeah you can see that going to the right and left here if I want to I, c I can speed it up um, I'll just play this part here with this here well I'll, s I'll speed up for you so like that But I don't want it to be too much, too much, so I just turn up like 50%. I'm just gonna play you guys the full beat here, and yeah, enjoy. Yeah, and that's about it. So guys, if you like this video, uh, can you please give it a like? Uh, <laughs> if you enjoyed this video, can you please give it a like? Uh, a sub would be amazing. And yeah, I know this is kind of a different, I already said this in the beginning, but this is a very different video for me to make. I usually play my guitar and make loops and stuff. Follow my socials in the description and I'll see you guys in the next video. So guys, I forgot to mention that if you want to purchase this beat, uh, whenever I release it on my YouTube channel, which will be in a, probably a couple of days, uh, just DM me on Instagram saying that you will, you want to purchase the beat. Um, you probably send the money first. Uh, the prices are will be in the description of the video, uh, and then you'll pay me first, uh, and I'll send you the beat through email, and that's about it. So yeah, uh, see you later, guys. Bye. Thank you.